folks, you know, this is our latest and greatest all-purpose, high-volume, high-output contractor grade Ozo machine. It comes in a small package. It's lightweight, but boy does it pack a wallop with at over 3,000 CFMs. And folks, that's not what important. What's important today, we're going to show you an application of this machine, whether you're in the odor removal business, the sanitizing business, or especially the duct cleaning business, folks. This machine is just the ideal tool. And folks, I talked to you about filing a patent for our vertically oriented ozone generators. And this falls under our pressurizing machine patent too because this machine can generate both high volumes and high pressures. But folks, you may not be aware, in the duct cleaning business, there's a standard 12 inch duct cleaning port. And we'll show you, if you can come in close, we're gonna show you this port right here. This is a standard 12 inch duct cleaning port. It's been sealed up by the last duct cleaning. Now, they use the wrong type of tape, but I just have this up here for ease of this video purposes to show you how this works. And if you'll see, that 12 inch porthole is perfect for our 12 inch pressurizing hose. So I'm gonna go ahead and take this off, and we'll just set this here for easy reinstallation. And we'll get our 12 inch duct cleaning hose. Be right back. But we're gonna finish installing our duct hose. It's a simple fit and just a quick cinch. Now we've installed our ozone rated pressurizing hose. And what we're going to do is we're going to insert this into our duct cleaning hole. Now that makes a pretty good seal in and of itself if you really want to go the extra nine yards which is not necessary because of the Venturi effect, you can seal this with duct tape. But in this particular application, it's, it's truly not necessary. So what we're going to do is we're going to sanitize these ducts. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna turn on the machine, set the timer. Now, you can do this one of two ways. The first way to do really quick sanitization. I mean, short term within minutes sanitize these ducts is you can block off all the cold air supplies and returns and what that will allow you to do is put this entire duct system under positive pressure and this is a positive pressurizing duct sanitizing machine or whole house sanitizing machine depending on your application so what that means is it will push, push more gas out of this system that is coming in. And this sealed off system, you do not need to run your blower motor inside the furnace. With this system, what you would do is you just block off all the supplies, block off all the returns, and then begin to sanitize. So again, as I mentioned, to sanitize these ducts in a hurry, if you're a duct cleaner, time is money, and you know, the EPA in 2011, I believe, said you can no longer start putting your system under negative pressure, fogging in an EPA approved duct sanitizer like Oxine, and say that you're sanitizing the duct because there's no way when you're sucking from one end and fogging from another to guarantee all the coverage of all the surfaces of a duct. Well folks, ozone is an EPA approved sanitizer in both its aqueous and gaseous states, or U.S. Department of Agriculture Organic Program approved sanitizer, excuse me, and that means that in its aqueous or its gaseous state, it is capable of sanitizing and disinfecting surfaces. And this is the gaseous state of ozone. Because it's a gas, it can get into tiny little nooks, crannies, crevices, and cul-de-sacs where no liquid-based disinfectant can penetrate, especially tiny little atomized fog particles like duct cleaners are familiar with using. And so in this application, if you sealed off all the vents, and then what you do is you begin pressurizing your system, the system will get up to concentration kill levels in just a few minutes because of the tiny area we're treating, which is just the interior surfaces of the ducts and furnace. If you want to get more involved than that, then you can take the whole house 
and put it under high levels of ozone gas and use the furnace blower to circulate the air. So you'd turn the fan to the on position and then you'd start the pressurizing or the sanitizing. In that case, you, you don't have anything blocked off. You let the cold air return suck the ozone in, you let the registers blow the ozone, ozone air out, and then you're using the furnace system of the house as the pump to move the gas throughout the entire structure. And in this way, you sanitize not just the air ducts, but the whole house. So with all of our machines, push button, Researchers at Penn State have discovered that once you get to concentration kill levels with ozone gas, it doesn't take hours to sanitize. It takes, doesn't take minutes to sanitize, it takes seconds. That's right, you can download this study at the Ozone Science tab of our website. And at Penn State, they found that once you get the ozone to kill concentration levels, which is 6 to 10 parts per million, in 10 seconds to 480 second applications at all the time intervals tested, they found that you got 99.99% kill of every virus and bacteria they tested in the study. So that means you can very quickly, very efficaciously sanitize the interior surfaces of the ducts, or you can use this machine to sanitize all the air, the surfaces in the house using the furnace blower as your mechanism to move that air. It's got a timer that you just spin, set the time, or you can manually control it. The vertical tornado ozone generator is a pressurizing machine extraordinaire covered by our full-blown patent and our patents pending. I encourage you, if you're in the duct cleaning business, if you're in the odor removal business or the sanitizing business, don't take my word for this. Buy one of these today. Try it for yourself and you'll see it does exactly what I said it does.